Hello everyone, Big Friendly Wargamer back doing another 40k Imperium unboxing. Um, now, I've got behind with these again, uh, so I do have two sets of this to do today. So I'm going to try and get it all done today. Um, I've got other things going on as well. Um, it is hot, it's really hot in the UK, so it's just it's half past 10 and it's like 26 degrees already. So you will hear my fan rattling in the background because it's the only thing I've got to cool my room. Uh, so what we've got is issue 43, 44, 45 and 46. Then we'll do issues 47, 48, 49 and 50 in, a, in the second one, which will come out in about in a few days. Um, I've got some extra bits as well. There's a binder that come with the first lot and then I've got my novella. Uh, Bones of the Martyr and... Kajamala's skull, whatever that is, that name is Kajamala's skull, I think it is. Uh, exclusive to Hatchet, apparently. Um, yeah, it's basically I, I haven't got on, on top of things and I didn't get back to them, so I ended up getting the special thing which I didn't really want, but I've got it, so I might as well keep it now. Um, so, yeah, so what I'm going to do is set the camera up and get started with the first batch. Alright, so we're starting off with issue 43. Um, you get one paint and uh, a small layer brush. The Stormhost Silver is actually a paint I really need, so that's good. That's good. I actually need that. I was going to go and buy a, set of paint, a pot of that uh, tomorrow, actually, so don't need to now. Um, right, so issue 43. Uh, this is about on the front. Or Adeptus Sororitas, whatever they're called, exactly what they're calling them there. So, again, going through how to name and title your miniatures. Um, yeah, giving you examples and stuff like that. Uh, heroic titles, unit titles. Um, going on to talk about Necrons. And their corrupted engrams and stuff like that. And again, I think this is a name naming thing. So you get to give all your um, characters titles and stuff. Talking about the Thousand Suns, which is a Space Ring uh, chapter or Legion, sorry. Uh, they're fell to chaos. Just giving you the basics of them. The, the Scourge Stars, which is a Sex, uh, sex, section of the galaxy um, talking about Nurgle uh, the great game which is the game between the forecast gods let's try just turn that off that's better um, how to paint using uh, edge highlights which is what your small layer brush would be for but you probably need a smaller brush for that um, it, Using Stormhost Silver for their highlights. Got Necrons, and then moving on to the uh, Ultramarines. There you go. Um, and basically, the Sacred Rites for the Adeptosaurus is basically is their um, like chapter tactics. It's how, how their different um, uh, branches use different tactics and stuff like that. A tutorial of it. Uh, mission is Master's Rest. But the actual scout mission is called Cover the Retreat. So that is issue 43. Now issue 44 has a repeat of a previous issue. It's the Building Sprue. Um, it is exactly the same one as, as we've got before, so I won't do a quick look at that. So let's put that away here. So issue 44, got the uh, white scars on the cover. Um, talking about um, Holy Ground, which is basically the... Uh, uh, Adeptus Minosaurum uh, strongholds, so sister battles, it's like their churches and stuff like that. Um, again, going through, you can name their, 
the districts and the churches and whatever. Talking about White Scars, which is a Space Ring chapter, a Loyalist Space Ring chapter. Um, Corosaro Khan, which is their chapter master now, I believe. Uh, talking about their use of bikes a lot. Um, the Reign of Blood, which is a time, time in the actual um, the timeline of the Imperium, when it was ruled by uh, a zealot who used to sacrifice innocents. Uh, talking about his fall and and the decrees that came after that how to build the building again how to paint the building again but this is going to be practically the same as last time I think they may have changed the colours a little bit but who knows um, and it's talking about placing terrain this is the tutorial for this this issue Placing terrain on your battlefield, how to do it. Strategic reserves, this units coming on from deep strike or outflank or something like that, and how to use how to actually work that. Um, and the game is called Battle for the Spires, with the mission being called Domination, and that is issue 44. Now issue 45 is going back to uh, the Necrons. Now this is a Canoptic Wraith. Let's put this to one side for a moment so I can show you the model. So this is the full kit. This is one of three. I believe there's two more to come. Um, so you've got all of the options on there. You've got the uh, particle beamer uh, yeah it's got it's whips and all that kind of stuff it's a nice kit don't get me wrong I don't think I'll be using this though and I've got obviously it's base which is a bigger base than my old ones were on issue 45 So first off we've got this nice fold out piece talking about the Tyranids and the Tau Empire and Eldari, the aliens of the galaxies, of the galaxy, sorry. And then on to the issue itself. Obviously he's talking straight about uh, Canoptic Race and uh, basically what they do. Obviously, you can name each one again. Back to talking about the Adeptosaurus weapons and war gear. And you can name all your swords and stuff. Um, this is Order of the Val Valorous Heart. It's one of the orders of the um, Sisters of Battle. Um, and there's another one, the Argent Shroud. Talking about the Astra Militarum, which is the human part of the. Uh, Imperium, which is just the standard soldiers and stuff like that. Going on to how to build the Wraith. Again, you've got options, different weapons and stuff. Now that 50mm base seems a bit too much. I'll put mine on my 40mm if I do build these days. And how to paint, how to paint the Canoptic Wraith. And then obviously giving you his stats. So it's got a choice of it's got two two guns it can take and it's got two close combat weapons it can have as well. A tutorial of how they work. Uh, the uh, game is called Canoptic In Infestation. And the mission is called Cleanse the Hive. And that is issue 45. Right, issue 46. Now, put that to one side for a moment. This is the first sprue of, uh, uh, I think, three or two or three, which they're almost the same. So, this is Sister Battle. So, you've got the Repenters Chainsword there. Now, uh, you've got the Jump Pack uh, Seraphim, I believe. And there's obviously 
uh, Arco Flagrants in there, then the Sister Battle, of course. Um, they are all monopose, I believe. But they're a nice kit. Just uh, not something I'm interested in at the moment. Zoom back out and then on to issue 46. Obviously, showing you what you get in, in this sprue. So it looks like you've got two um, Seraphim, uh, three Sisters of Battle, and then two Arco Flag Flagellants, I think they're called. Um, Battle Sisters, talking about the Warriors of the Faith. And obviously, telling you about what you've just got. You can name them all, of course. Um, and talking about Seraphim Squad, which are the Jump Pack ladies. Um, their bolt pistols, the power swords, and their jump packs, their equipment. You can name all of them as well. How to build them. How to build all the models you got on this sprue. And obviously, that should be what you get. And then how to paint. And of course, this is going to be quite a lot because there's a number of models here and they're all kind of different so quite a few pages of how to paint these guys and ladies sorry obviously the uh, battle sister squads uh seraphim squads that's the rules for them how to use them in the tutorials and the game is called head for the surface with the mission being called engage and eliminates so that's issue 46. Looking ahead, uh, issue 47, we've got a couple of paints. Nothing special there, to be honest. Uh, Pink Horror and Wild, Wild, Wild Rider Red. And then issue 48, more ruins. Yay. So that is issue 46. All right, so there you go. That is issues 43, 44, 45, and 46. Um, not a lot in that. I mean there's lots of we've got loads of ruins everywhere again um, and paints and brushes but there you go thank you very much if you have been watching these hopefully they've been of use to someone um, in the description below you'll find links to my Instagram page and my Facebook page where I post what I'm painting and stuff like that my video my channel is mostly about hobby um, and yeah thank you very much I will catch you again in a little while with this second um, batch from this lot. See you soon. Bye bye.